And we're back! Finally guys, I miss YouTube so much and I missed you guys so much. It's been about four to five months since the last episode that we've uploaded. Actually, I took a quick break because and dami nating mga projects na ginago, which I will be announcing one at a time in later videos. We're back to being consistent on YouTube and one of those projects pag-usapan natin ngayon. We're back in Monterrazas de Cebu where the Skypod 2.0 or Monterrazas Prime is being built. Pero, syempre, when you're in a subdivision, gusto mong meron tayong magandang clubhouse. And the facility we're talking about today is probably the biggest, most luxurious, for me personally, most awesome clubhouse in Cebu. So guys, today, we are going to check out the Montesima Clubhouse of Monterrazas de Cebu. Basically, what happened is Monterrazas de Cebu reached out to us and partnered with us na tayo na ang magma-master plan ng buong property dito. Medyo pressure, pero super exciting because we will be able to design the entire place holistically. Guys, the first time I've ever stepped foot on this area, parang I had goosebumps because this area is one of the highest points in Monterrazas de Cebu and it has a 300 and 60 degree view of the city. Sunrise towards this side and dito nakikita na natin yung sun slowly setting in that direction and may fog pa. Now before we begin this tour, I just wanted to share to you the design principles behind this project. Kasi meron na tong dating design eh. And we took that down and we replaced it with something new because after Typhoon Odette and after the whole pandemic situation, we felt like since it's at the very top of the mountain, it has to be more typhoon resistant. So we wanted to incorporate that in the design. And that made us decide to make the whole design into a brutalist type of architecture, which means halos concrete lahat makikita natin. And syempre, medyo cold siya tingnan. Nilagyan natin ng foliage all over, may mga landscaping, and it's gonna be as green as possible. Think of it like a Bali resort type of vibe. So, yun yung aim namin dito. Bali resort type of vibe, but in the highest peak of Monterrazas de Cebu. Now, speaking of brutalist architecture and incorporating nature in our design, bagay na bagay yung sponsor natin for today's video, which is the Wholesome XL Eco Planet. Now, for any building structure, the most carbon footprint that we impart on our planet is in the construction phase. And syempre, we want to minimize that impact. Now, even here, although we are in a mountain, this was all grass areas. Absolutely no trees were cut down for this project. Now, the whole Sim Eco Planet is an environmentally friendly cement that uses mga byproducts from other industries that make it more sustainable. So instead of a lot of limestone, clay, and silica, it uses mga substitutes. This means that it saves on natural resources, reduces the energy consumption needed to cook the cement, and significantly reduces carbon emissions. So check out Likas at Lakas website for more information and to look for the nearest stores if you're planning to buy the Wholesim XL Eco Planet. Hashtag Likas at Lakas. So we start off our tour here at the drop-off area. This is a three-level structure. So my roof deck tayo, my main area, which is that level over there. And then meron tayong basement area. So I'll talk you through our thinking when we were designing this project. So we decided to put a few steps before actually seeing everything from a vantage point. Para may konting suspense, hindi yung pag drop off mo, kita agad yung view. Gusto namin na medyo, alam yung may tease na konti. <laughs> Akyat tayo dito, and I'll show you around. So, this is going to be the first level that greets you. Now, this area is not meant to be an enclosed area. Think of it more as a shaded area. Kasi gusto namin may breeze from left to right, and then maaliwalas talaga. This is the area wherein you go swimming, you have like, weekend outings, outings with the family and just see your kids running around. This is a very big and spacious area. Once you get to this area, you also have a peak of the city view. And then, meron dito, makikita mo going down, is a small pocket of greenery. These trees, pag lumalabong na to, these are newly planted. Parang na-frame nila or may foreground ka before you actually see the city view. This is also the floor wherein meron tayong almost 
an Olympic size swimming pool, infinity pool siya. But meron din tong ramp going up to the roof deck. Again, this is a full concrete design. So meron tayong roof deck that number one is very typhoon resistant. Number two, it will be an area for health and wellness. Imagine doing yoga here during the sunrise or the sunset. Imagine doing aerobics, yung si Lolo at si Lola. That's why we created that ramp for it to be accessible to them as well. So I'll show you the pool. So I think this part, yung mga stakes na to, this is going to be where there's a very big bathroom and shower room to service the pool. Once we go to that area, makikita natin yung pool over there, which we can get to here. This marks the boundaries of the pool. It's a sweeping curve pool and you can do a lot of laps. There's also a shallow area for the kids. But the beauty of this when we were designing it was that view over there. So if you're standing from this vantage point, you'll see the pool infinity towards that view on the front. So I can imagine a perfect Sunday here instead of Dun la ako sa bahay ko, I get to mingle with everyone that's living here in this subdivision. And parang my sense of community. Ito talaga gusto namin mangyari dito sa Monterrazas de Cebu. That everyone can mingle with each other and get to know their neighbors. As good as all those sound, and I'm very excited for the pool. That's not all, ma'am sir. This is a ramp going down to the lower level. So, si Lola at Lolo, dito sila dadaan. Pero, dun sa gitna mismo, meron din tayong spiral staircase that takes us either to the roof deck or down to the lower levels. The lower levels are more of our indoor spaces. So, let's take the ramp for now. When you're going down, it has to be at a certain slope. Siyempre, if meron tayong kasama na nag-wheelchair, dapat mabagal yung slope, hindi yung pag nabitawan mo, diretso na sila. There's a standard for that. Once you go down, you're greeted with a lot of other amenities that basically makes this clubhouse, para sa akin, one of a kind. Number one, pagdating mo dito, you're greeted with this pocket garden. And ito yung nagiging centerpiece where all the rooms of this level are kind of facing. So there's going to be a health and wellness center in this area. So there's going to be saunas, there's going to be a fully equipped gym, and there's going to be an area wherein it kind of is a multi-purpose area where you can do your boxing, you can do your yoga, you can do your anong mga sport na gusto mo. So it's an open space na parang gym na rin, aerobics area, you can dance, whatever. Meron pang kids area na nilalagay natin. Alam mo yung uso ngayon na may mga ball pit, sa mga birthday nila Scotty, naglalaro sila. So, meron din tayong maliit na area for the little chikitings. And not only that, nilagyan din natin ng area na for mga meeting rooms. So, if ever gusto mo may mga corporate meetings ka, dito na kayong magmi-meet. So, it's a all-in-one space. These markings, by the way, <laughs> ito yung mga stakes natin. So, we know where to build. Ito yung huhukayin. Lalagay tayo ng foundation. <laughs> Quick trivia lang. But, 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 that's not all, ma'am sir. This area that you see right here is hollowed out for one specific reason. And that is, this will have a 200 to 300 person function room that spills over to a garden outside. So that will cater to a lot of birthday parties, even weddings, or on Sundays, we're planning to have this as a place where people can hold mass. So again, with all the, the dreams of creating a community instead of bahay, 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 and no one talking to each other. Parang mapabili ako ng lupa dito. <laughs> the function room also faces towards a garden right outside. That garden will have mga kiddie amenities, so mga outdoor swing set. We're still thinking of what to put there, but naiimagine lang namin this whole place to be a place wherein families can gather. This will be a place where people can celebrate their birthdays, their children's party, Mother's Day, Father's Day, even have dates here. We want this to be a center of a community na parang magiging proud yung residents na, oy, meron kami ng ganyan dito. Tara, punta tayo. So, this is hopefully going to be that place in the future. So that area right there is where the sun rises. This is east and behind us is west. So that's where it's setting. So again, 360 degree view talaga. And now it's late in the afternoon, the sun is setting. And I imagine ko lang when this is all done, I'll be having a glass of wine here, 
chill chill ka. Ito yung pool, infinity pool. Just facing the view of the city, muni muni. <laughs> Ang ganda siguro. So that's something I'm very very excited about for this project. Pero andami pa namin ginagawa dito sa Monterrazas de Cebu. So I can't wait to see everyone's faces when this is complete. So baka meron din tayong physical or real world house tour. Ano ba yung tamang term? <laughs> Clubhouse tour. Anyway guys, fun to be back on YouTube again. So I plan to be very very consistent na. So subscribe na kayo guys. I hope you enjoyed today's video and I'll see you later.